service. That's Harris Ace Hardware. Harris Ace is your place for Yeti coolers, Traeger grills, Costa Demar sunglasses, Calcutta Renegade coolers, plus Harris Ace is your hometown dealer for yellow wood treated lumber. Harris Ace will not be undersold on price, so you know you're getting the best price at Harris Ace. Your favorite place for hardware and lumber supplies is Harris Ace Hardware, West Cherry Street in Jessup. It's time now for local ladies in local sports and sports. Eight teams standing in girls 5A basketball after last night, and our Lady Yellow Jackets are one of the Elite Eight as they travel last night to Harris County, beat Harris County 46-42 to move into the Elite Eight round where they'll play Columbia, who beat Bass 59-43. Other winners, Eagles Landing and Villarica meet. Eagles Landing defeated Stars Mill 41-38. Villarica defeated Arabia Mountain 60-52. On the other side, veterans will beat Buford as veterans knocked out Statesburg 49-47, and Buford beat Carrollton 62-32. Also in the Elite Eight, Griffin in Southwest DeKalb, Griffin over Jones County 69-48, and Southwest DeKalb over Rome 53-39. If Wayne County wins over Columbia, they'll meet the winner of the Equals Landing Villa Rica matchup. At this time, Wayne County doesn't know if they're at home or away. So it comes down to that dreaded coin flip. Kayla Hobbs and the girls will join us this morning on the World Famous Bitch and Bob Show. Give us the details of last night's win and about them moving on to the Elite Eight in 5A girls basketball. Again, our congrats to Coach Kayla Hobbs, who continues to have the ladies basketball program in the top of the state competition. Again, made it to the Final Four a few years ago. Now in the Elite Eight this year, Taryn Ward had 28 points to junior last night. Also grabbed her 100th rebound in her career. A.J. Jefferson had six points, had Four key free throws down the stretch, and Logan Nichols had five points to the charge late in the game to give Wayne County the position back. Again, Wayne County a winner last night up at Harris County. 46-42 is the final. They move on to the Elite Eight. Tonight we've got boys basketball action here at home at the Benny Ratliff Arena. Sweet 16 action against Dutchtown. Again, tip off at 6.30. If Wayne County wins, they move on to the Elite Eight. Here's a look at the 16 teams left in boys 5A basketball. Again, on the left side of the bracket, Wayne County hosting Dutchtown. The other matchups, Villarica and Buford, Woodland and Jonesburg, Carrollton and Southwest of Cab. On the right side of the bracket, it's Fade County against Equals Landing, Cedar Shoals and Kell, Stars Mill and Warner Robinson, Lithonia and Rome. And Wayne County looking to move into the Elite Eight as the girls did last night. And come on out tonight, support the Wayne County boys basketball team. Again, the time of the game is 630. High school baseball game scheduled for Wednesday at Effingham County, called off due to bad weather at Effingham. No makeup date has been set. Our next broadcast set for tomorrow, Friday at 6 p.m. at Richmond Hill. Pre-game tomorrow begins at 5.50. Jackets won Tuesday with a dramatic come-from-behind win. Trailing 9-3, headed to the bottom of the seventh. Jackets scored seven runs in the last inning to win 10-9. Senior David Mosley with the walk-off two-run single to win the game. Cooper Martin picks up the win on the mound as he pitched the seventh inning. Struck out the side. The senior shortstop looking to see more time on the pitcher's mound this year. Jackets currently at 4-1, to currently ranked 6th in the latest state polls. University of Buford at n- number 1, Loganville at 2, Ola 3, Carrollton 4, Locust Grove 5, Wayne County comes in at 6, Whitewater 7th, Harris County 8th, Villarica 9th, and Stars Mill rounds out your top 10 at the moment in 5A baseball. Jackets will see Loganville next weekend at that Peach Classic in Atlanta. Once again, next game tomorrow afternoon, 6 p.m. at Richmond Hill. Pre-game tomorrow at 5.50. Again, a reminder tonight, come on out and support the boys' basketball team. Taking on Dutch Town at 6.30, and with the win, they move into the Elite Eight action. That's going to do it for latest in local sports. Sports is brought to you each and every day at this time by friends at Harris Ace Hardware. Like my drill sergeant used to say, it's showtime. Woody Folsom Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram Baxley has over 600 new vehicles on the ground, nearly 300 new Rams, and it's Ram Truck Month. Save up to 33% off.